I'm Rebus, and today I am sharing with you all my second completed Infinity Conquest of the season, and the, uh, my first one post OTA, which I did uh, using Loki, uh, and specifically uh, this variation of Loki, which may look a little bit similar, uh, different from some of the other lists you might see. Um, in particular, I use uh, th three pretty crucial tech cards that I like, uh, Cosmo, Juggernaut, and Mobius. And then I go pretty sparingly on the Loki package and the Sabu package with Shang-Chi Marvel, and then the essentials for the Loki package, which is Quinchet, Snowguard, Coulson, and Loki, and Mirage can shuffle in and out depending on what your preference is. And lastly, I have Dino, which gives you some games where you don't Loki and maybe you're just playing for like your big Coulson stuff, dropping a Dino, it's very solid. Um, so coming post patch, uh, one of the biggest changes that came was to Lockjaw, bringing it to a four cost, which honestly kind of just takes it out of Thanos and Hela. I think they're both better off not running the card. It's super awkward to fit into the curve. Um, so this helps, surprisingly helps Loki a, a lot, even though Loki has a good matchup into Thanos, because now the Thanos high rolls are way, way uh, more inconsistent. And Hela, which was a big counter to Loki, um, being a lot less prevalent, is also really good for the deck. Uh, even Destroy, having the Forge change, removes one of the Destroy's ways to beat Loki, which is by making a very large Deadpool. And this can kind of offset the uh, stealing of Null and Death if they also have like a 24 power Deadpool to play alongside their cards. Uh, they can oftentimes be. Um, so this is kind of why I like the Cosmo in here. It can help you in the destroy matchup. Uh, it also helps you in the tech matchup. I think one thing we'll see coming up, this is my prediction of the meta, is that we'll see a split of two types of decks. We'll see decks that are super tall and don't use any tech. We'll see Negative Tribunal is the most popular deck is in Infinity Conquest right now. Um, you'll see lots of Destroy, which tries to go really tall. And to counterbalance that, um, as there always is, is good after a patch, we'll see a lot of tech decks. Sarah Control, I think, is in a really good spot right now with people trying to figure out what to uh, build. It can counter a lot of suboptimal decks. And I think Loki is one of those decks that can be a tech deck, right? I think uh, one of the reasons Loki struggles to ever show like amazing stats on ladder, um, while it shows really good stats in Conquest, is that the tech choices and Loki are super crucial to winning games and being able to know when you should Loki and when you shouldn't so that you can keep your tech options, uh, in this case Mobius, Juggernaut, Cosmo, uh, and Shang-Chi. Right, we have to decide in our games, is Loki something that we need to Hail Mary for or something that will win us the game? Or do we need to play out this Mobius, this uh, like in Mobius into Miss Marvel, Dino, this way we can have our Juggernaut to like knock off an Onslaught off of an Iron Man lane on the final turn. So things like that, super important to think about. Uh, I do think this Conquest does a good job of showing that, uh, although I do get baited by the Loki a few times. Uh, definitely not a super expert with the deck, but I have played it a lot and I do enjoy this variation. So um, yeah, so that's something to keep out for. Um, otherwise, yeah, that's just my prediction for how the metagame is going to go. I'll definitely follow up as I keep playing Infinity Conquest. I think I have like nine more tickets to go. Um, try and win at least three of those so I can hit enough av uh, 40 avatars. I think I'm almost there. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think, what kind of decks you're seeing. Be strong and popular. What kind of results you're having. Take a look at the games. I think they're really good as far as like uh, whenever I do Infinity Conquest, I try and think a lot through a lot more. Uh, even when I'm streaming, so yeah, definitely let me know if you learn anything from this, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace. Um, one and three. Rip. Need like something spicy from the Coulson. Oh, 
play Null next turn. enough for it. Escaped. Oh, it's just like I face these people all the time, man. Like, nobody ever says GG when they lose. They only ever do it when they win. Here, come on, your deck. I shouldn't pass. I'd rather draw the card. Sorry, Mobius, man. Just been phenomenal. No, it's, yeah, I mean, they've been favored, but it's nothing crazy. Some Loki, I think I have Loki next turn. Reason to Loki now. In this again. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Okay. Yeah, I mean, they got a lot of good locations here. That happens. Do this into Loki. Hopefully, I get a Snow Guard. This, this turns off their death if they're gonna try and save it. If I don't get snuggered though, I don't get enough cards to guarantee a win, I don't think. And if I play Death Year, like Death Venom, I probably just lose. I mean, I have Shang too. They got what from a random Nico? Wow, they played out both now. Doesn't that give me ways to win? I guess it's kind of hard to win over here. Zabu, man. Means I can't get there, right? Tonight, pretty shitty, but it's fine. Puts me to nine, but they already have a two power guy, and then they just need to stick one more guy here and they win. Is this enough? It's only plus three here, which is not enough. Alright, I'll just leave. It's close, but don't go with it there. If I had a Zabu earlier, we could have done it with, ne with a Loki, but... I don't know what they're thinking about here. You always just play mid. Maybe they'll convince themselves to retreat. Been horrendously unlucky today.
Might be a Loki on four, so maybe I can utilize this for me. Yeah, I mean, I've won the majority of my games today. I just... The important ones I have not. Nexus is really good for me now. I need Shang though, because Drug probably won't be enough if they got on it early. Let me snap this. I don't think I can snap this until I get a Shang Chi. Loki that maybe. I don't know if Loki will be enough. I'll try it. Like if we play the same stuff middle, it'll just be me but bigger. Right. I need this to go left. And I miss the null. So I'm dead. I hope I draw Shang-Chi. I also have to hope that this Wolverine goes mid or left so that I throw Priya. Or sorry, mid or right. Okay, I think I throw Priya here always. One Shang, please. Rip. They have one card. If it's a null, I lose. If it's a death, I win. How much of a gambler are we, chat? They only have one card in hand. And they just drew it. I'll bet a cube that it's not null. Yeah. Victory. They also have to be afraid of me having null, right? Like null death. It's Nico, maybe. Drug is best, yeah, drug is very good. Glad you're enjoying it, David. Hoi yay yay man, I am they're having very good locations. Thankfully they are afraid of snapping to their very core. So I get to like find out like can I win, right? Cosma, probably worth it. Into Loki. I don't know how I beat these Deadpools, so. Huh? Maybe double Cosma's not worth it. Don't snap this. Yeah, no, they're afraid. How good is two dinos here? Probably not enough to beat the 20 power deadpools, right? I'll leave on bad locations like this. Escaped. 
Maybe I'm not supposed to cause one, I'm just supposed to pray for a Shang-Chi. Probably a better play. Yeah, I probably that's probably misplay by me. Probably can't play for Cosmo in that scenario. Since I could do double Shang-Chi, it's probably worth playing for that. So I, I think a single Shang-Chi is where it can get weird. I think Pryo vs. Destroy is hard, yeah. Ah, oh, they get to see the drug for free. I lose my Zabu. Play this up. Uh, throw Coulson in there. Threat is not good. Yeah, Cosmo's more of a hell attack, but I probably don't need it in the deck anymore. I think Drug is still good, but Cosmo is probably not necessary. No Loki, no Shang. Test Strike. Uh. They can't play the death. So maybe Shang will be enough. I can't play anything alongside the Shang's issue, right? Deadpool's four. Okay, so they're just setting up for a null, right? Wow, oh, that sucks, right? Because I can't beat it. Actually, wait. This beats it, right? So that's 15 middle. Boomer snap. Victory. I'm actually surprised they leave there. Yeah, it's probably Roker Enchantress. I'll make that change after the game. Maybe they didn't have a null. Yeah, it could be Killmonger. I mean, it's really weird to Killmonger left if you're playing out your Deadpool. So probably not Killmonger, right? I don't know, I can't be Killmonger. That makes no sense. I should have Pryo here. There's a Limbo. My dog might die. <laughs> oh, this feels omega bad. Do you think they fill here though? Isn't that kind of weird? Probably not, right? I wanted that to go back mid. I don't want to kill their stuff, man. Mid, bro. Why not Hawk? I want to save the Hawk for the Limbo. Obviously, in hindsight, it's slightly better, but... Yeah, I want to hold it for the Limbo. Maybe it was worth it, I don't know. 
I mean, like, having both of them go left is just extremely unlucky, right? I feel like if they stayed in the same location, I was fine. <sighs> Super weak hand for me. I don't want to turn off Limbo now. Because I can't win over here. Right? Can I win if the time's too Nico? It seems bad. Yeah, I think I hold the Hawk a turn so I can like try and take advantage of Shang. And maybe my Mobius catches out their death. Yeah, we're here. I can Shang the Null too if I want to. Just have more options. Last time I snapped, they retreated in this scenario. I want four cubes here, so I'm not going to snap them. But we should have them 100% of the time. They might have already retreated. Alright, they did not. Perfect. Winning every lane is important here. So as cute as a Hawk Shang is, like, that means I'd lose right, right? I'll play some for Mirage, you can probably run a Sentinel, it's slightly worse though. But like, you'll survive. Okay, good start, good start. Fifty prior. We got it. <laughs> oh, two more chat. Oh, we got a full house. The rogue better. Than I think drug is good. Uh, I think rogue might be better than Cosmo right now. Almost snappable hand. Yeah. Oh, baby. This is very good. What do you about Sarah? I don't like Sarah. Personally, but... It's okay. It just makes her weakness to Mobius a lot harsher, right? Is this just a Tempo Shang here? It might just be a Tempo Shang. Their death costs 6, so I'm probably never hitting the death. Can go like Drug, Rock, Rock or something. Oh, they didn't want the Forge buff, that's crazy. But yeah, 3 power from Shang is meaningful here. All systems go. Uh, drug? Drug is very good. That is why. This helps you win games. This is a tech card. I don't even really want to knock away whatever they play on the right, but it's not like I have another choice. Nice chat. Four rocks, easy win. Actual useful rocks, yeah. I don't know, not... Cosmo did put some work in here. <laughs> I 
and destroy in some situations. Destroy 50-50. Uh, I think it's a little bit more favored for Loki than 50-50. I don't know how much more though. I guess M'Baku is better than Dagger. Not by much though. I'm gonna Snowguard the Vesuvius. I mean, I might want the Vesuvius to Boomer Snap him. Loki Marvel in hand is very good. I get to go Mobius into Loki here. The only reason I think I would hold this snow guard is if I see them play magic, then I'd probably hold it. All right, why are they full roping me turn two? Sussy. Took them that long to play a lizard. Yeah, Triskelion was pretty good. I mean, I already had the Snow Guard, so it's not that helpful, but it's fine. Alright, Shocker does nothing here. Full skip. I don't need to snap now, right? Infinite, they can't infinite. Mobius. I need something big enough to win mid is the issue. I should do it, right? This is... At 13. Yeah, hold on, let me hide the screen. We're gonna go for eight cubes. Play for eight. Yeah, we have Mobius, they can't play anything, Trout. They can't play any troop cards. I just have to hide in case they do like Small card, small card, or something. Small card, small card. So they can't see exactly how much. Surprise! I was expecting Big Hulk over here to fight for all three. Yeah, I'm surprised they snapped Tree Hulk over Hulk. But I'm not going to question it. Mobius does a lot of work in this. Yeah, like like Luke Cage plus like Cyclops or something. Yeah, that's what I was trying to make sure I beat. Bolt snap. Yeah, pretty bolt snap. That's true. Just put them in for two. I don't know if we put them into two for on a limbo game. Central Park, too. Maybe with a Mobius? I don't think so. I'd rather wait. Like, I think they're favorite here. The extra turn, especially. It's a bad matchup for them. It's an okay matchup for them. I mean, now it's a bad matchup because they're down eight. Yo, oh, nice flowers. Good job. Can 
Gretsch's. First avatar is always the hardest. Because they get effects and I don't have effects on my cards. And a leech man. Are these full skip? I don't know why they're full skipping. I need more big cards, right? Drug is so good though. Ah, look, he's probably worth it with Quindred out, right? Uh, let's not play Mirage. Most stuff I get is bigger than Mirage. Do we need the Shang? I don't think so. Oh, I was really hoping for Miss Marvel here. I mean, I can still contest here. here. Speed's Hulk. So I probably stay. It's their most likely play. I'm good. I'm good. Is it locked down if you're running Shang and Enchantress? I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> I just find it funny that like there's a whole... Honestly, no cap, like the Black Bolt stature stuff is pretty pretty good into Loki. Honestly, I could snap this if I had a 2 drop. Without a 2-drop, I can't. It's one of the non-Loki hands that's just like insane, because you got a ton of tempo with Coulson. Is it Shuri? I don't know what would run armor. I guess we'll find out here. I can even Loki them. Nihilus. Mobius. Sure. Sarah control then? This comes down next turn. Sarah control, okay. Miss a draw here, it's a little bit sussy. Stops their Sarah, which is huge. Probably what they're playing this turn. Max is great. Shang is not great. Oh, awkward. But they have no Miss Marvel. Anything's good? Yeah, I mean, you can run any card in that slot, but you shouldn't run armor, in my opinion. They're playing this for eight. Okay. Oh, 
We're just going stouts. Okay, bro. Hmm. They're trying to shrink the beta ray bill. Kind of cope to hope that I'm top decking the hammer there with one draw for it. But... Is that just one? Yeah, and I just bumped them back, and then I muted them. <laughs> uh, pretty rough to end here, but Motro is bad for their deck. Muted them first just to be sure, yeah. Just so I don't forget. This goes here and then I go to drug and hopefully I get Colson would be the best. Cosmo mid. I'm gonna plan on taking Pryo and drugging mid. Wow, they're gonna tempo Maximus me? Huh? Cause their goal is to stay behind priority, right? So they're gonna... Wow, they're taking Pryo? Oh, they're just proactively enchantressing? Okay. Oh yeah, I did not expect this. Sure. Um, but I know it's tiniest issue here, but they can't play into Motor Worlds. The issue is I lose to Miss Marvel if I knock it out of mid, right? I should leave. Alright, the hand would stretch back mid. So I should just leave. It's fine, we just have to play it out until either they don't have Mobius or we just went through some RNG. So they can get into Dust Domain and I can't. Shang doesn't do anything in the matchup. Drug is bad here. I think I leave. I mean, in the Sarah matchup, you drop uh, Mobius on turn 5. I have one more free retreat, and then we're playing out every game. I'm fine here, I'll stay. I'll be goes mid. Yeah, I mean, that's why you're not supposed to do that. Mobius? Sure. Hmm, I really want to miss Marvel here, but I can't. Try to stick for their Mobius. 
feel like I do. I get their enchantress too, it can be good here. Okay. Dino? Well, there's my Mobius. Rip. Best draw is Quindrep for me. Didn't get it. That being said, we both have Sarah. I do miss out on my Marvel bonus here, but I definitely need to Enchantress it. Ah, Quindrep's Eternal Light. Oh, Enchantress on Mobius doesn't undo the cost reduction? That's a bug, right? There's still full cost. Yeah, that's some BS. That's really weird. I should not get why that works that way. 14, it goes to tiebreaker that I lose, unfortunately. Wait. Ah, I still lose it. Yeah, the cost reduction cost me the game, right? Transform mechanic? Well, it's broken. That's not how it should work. It, that's not how it worked before, for sure. It's definitely related to the transform thing. It's actually a huge boon in this matchup. It's like really sucky. Because I would have won that otherwise. Sanctum, it's not good for me, but what can I do? I have Enchantress first and Loki, but there's no way to do that in this matchup, right? Okay. Just have to hope they don't have Mobius. To get their draw for it. No draw. I did get my movies. Oh, I got their movies is better. Should just play this here. Should play this so I can double Marvel if I get it. And no, then I can't play this, right? I don't want to play this. This takes Pryo, which sucks. Like this, this leads me to Enchantress, right? I want to be able to double Miss Marvel if I get a Miss Marvel here. I guess I can just Miss Marvel here. I just hold it, I think. Just play Mobius and I hold. Yeah, I have to get Miss Marvel here. Just don't get there now, right? One more power here. Just 
loses on board, right? Just lost my board. They have to stay anyways. I want to play Snowguard into Mojo Royal because I can kill Mongary. Hopefully, I get a two drop from them. Okay, I didn't want that one. I just need to find their Mobius. How? David, there's no way. I don't have Enchantress in my deck. I can't Enchantress before I Loki. It's literally impossible. It's not a possible play that you can do. Mobius here means I lose most of the time. I didn't have Sarah though. The thing is, chat, it's bugged. I don't know how many times I have to say this. If 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 we enchant with some Mobius, my cards still cost their full amount. Five ten. The speech trough mid. Made to fourteen, but loses to trough here. Is there a better play? Not really. That's just this. to Miss Marvel. Uh, I lose to this too, right? Yeah, man, that bug is so frustrating. It's actually gonna cost me here. That's so frustrating, man. I don't get to play anything till turn three. I'm gonna report. What? Who am I supposed to report it to? No one listens to shit I post. The last card is Shang. I want the rescues, right? These are nines.
I can't put that there. I mean, I lost because there's a bug with Loki and Mobius. Sucks, man. Can't activate the rescue middle because it went in the wrong spot. Yeah, they had Mobius in their opener. I mean, nothing I can do about it. to go mid and then I probably lose a good portion of the time Enchantress or Mobius? Yeah, that's actually like really game breaking. The fact that Mobius works after you Enchantress it. Justice, yeah. Let's just put as many points as possible there. Got their enchants. Like I said, your boy, there's a bug where if you enchantress Mobius, it doesn't reduce your cards back. So it would not do anything. If I tried to gladiator left that game, even if I hit. I know, but it's just like. I don't know. How people critique plays in the wrong way is just annoying. Oh, it's this Galactus again. So we'll find out with the Loki. Mobius is better, right? It's either Galactus or it's Tribunal. Tribunal. I have drug. I'm just gonna snap this. And I'm not gonna look here. Insta lose for the deck? Not insta lose, but it's not good. They might play a um, scroll here. Drug and Mobius are going to carry this matchup. I'm surprised they didn't s snap turn 3 negative. It's kind of weird. I think I value the Sabu more here. I give up Miss Marble here. Yeah, so I need to hold on to this hawk. Probably over here. If I had like a dino, I could snap here. But like, where's my power? Right? I don't have any.
Okay, they got a flip to Mr. Negative. Right, like, where is my power? I can't end it here because I lose to just Onslaught somewhere, right? They're snapping me. I think that's fine. I'm going to try this. See if I can make it work. I'm not ending it. Did they think I was gonna end it? Flipped Iron Man. Uh, uh, gets me right. Thought for sure they'd play it mid if they were gonna try and do that. All right, let's do some quick maths. We just need to calculate tribunal, right? Tribunal is 19 times 2, 38 plus 12, 50 over 3, they get 16 a lane. Which disputes? It's 18. I'm not gonna snap because I don't know if my math is right. 9 plus 10, 19 times 4. I beat that, right? Although it's better. I think if I snap, they're gonna leave now because I took too long, right? Yeah, I think it took too long. Iron Man, shit. I lose to this too. Wait, how can they play both? Okay, so I'm, I was supposed to put this Mystique next to over here. Let's misplay. I don't know why I played it mid. 17 was enough. I misplayed. I, I forgot about the Mr. Negative being 4. I knew they had Mystique, right? So obviously I should expect that. Just a misplay by me. Stupid misplay. I spent too much time counting. I didn't think about that they could do different stuff. Okay, that's kind of frustrating, honestly. I can't win without that. TLT could have the plus 3 bonus, but then they lose because they don't get it multiplied by 2. On the Iron Man, right? So they get way less. They'd be at like 14 or something. It's a bad stay by me. It puts me behind in the match which sucks. This also really sucks, by the way. And now I'm supposed to win the Vidalia over here. Cash rank could be good, sure. Scroll. My Cosmo. Why are they running Scroll and Iron Lad? 
It's not bad. I don't know, maybe I'm missing something. I think I'm just dead. Don't really have much I can do here. I missed all my important cards for this matchup. Okay, um now they gave me a way to win. I don't know, if they beat this, it's pretty s require a really weird set of plays. I think they saw my play and they're gonna play around it. They're sniping, it sucks, but... Not sniping. Get out of here. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot about the Mr. Negative. <laughs> I thought we Cosmoed it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I thought we Cosmoed it. So I did not realize that that was a possible play they could make. Alright, we just need to win one out of the next three. No Zabu, so yeah, top cards are Onslaught and uh, the other one, right? Onslaught and Tribunal. Weird list, really weird. Stop their magic if they're trying to keep their hand. Very greedy. I don't even know if it's that greedy, it's just strange. So I'd say if they're playing Ravona, they don't play on the Abbey so that they can try and get a card draw. I feel like that card draw would be super weird for them. I don't know, that's just me. These two. Okay, so Sarah the turn. Jubilee. That's a good hit for them. I don't have any reduction here. I think this just wins. It's onslaught. Oh, 
Okay. Did I get my internet fixed? Uh, I changed some settings in OBS so that if it breaks again, I can fix it. Or like it won't be as bad. I just didn't have time. That's Octra isn't tier 1? Nah, that's probably tier B. Alright. They get to this because their opponent's a zero attack. Hey! We were playing their deck earlier, except I think a better version. I think it's Quinjet because if I draw a 2, I'd rather play a 2 than a Snowguard. Yeah. Oh, Mantis. Low collection level Loki. I mean, they definitely have Loki. They have a season pass avatar. <laughs> I don't have my Loki though, but I do have my Mobius. I need I needed Coulson though. Coulson is what you want in this matchup. Yeah. I want to draw closer to my Loki, right? Their hand is already full from the Coulson, so this is kind of free. I guess it's less good if they Loki this exact turn. Hercules. They're snapping me. Why? What could they be playing this turn? That'd be a reason to snap. Mobius? Am I not ahead if they Mobius me? I'll snap. I'm really far ahead, I think. The dino? If they if I don't get the Shang, Dino is kinda scary. I did not get the Shang. I didn't get a Shang and I didn't get their Dyna. That being said... Can they beat this? Oh, do I send it? I lose to Mystique too. Not gonna Marvel, I don't think they run Marvel. Only lose to Mystique. Low collection, yeah, so I'm assuming they don't have Mystique. A little bit. Played around their Nick Fury. I think they have to split, so so the, their play is correct, it looks weird, but they have to split because otherwise I just play a dino into whatever lane they stack, right? They don't know what I took from Loki, right? This is why Loki's kind of busted. Like, I, I assume that they have to split because I could just play a big card in one of the lanes, or even middle, and I would have won, right? So they're trying to beat me, like, playing dino middle and stuff. I don't think they realize how cheap it was with Quinjet, but... I didn't want to play this matchup from behind. That sounds miserable. There was a 32 minute infinite conquest. Hey, if I play infinite conquest, it doesn't matter your collection level. It's just, can you get four wins in a row? My opponent had four wins in a row with that deck. Yeah, juice. All right, that was... <laughs> It's it, it's kind of anticlimactic because that was the easiest match out of the the run, I think. <laughs>